In the very early days of the COVID-19 pandemic, I shared this interesting illustration from Visual Capitalist showing the history of pandemics and the number of lives lost from each one. Now, 18 months later, we wanted to see how COVID-19 has changed in size and scale. Let's start by taking a look back at my original report from March of 2020. Here's the number of deaths on a timeline from the year 165 AD through the centuries. Here's the Black Death or bubonic plague in the 14th century. Here's smallpox. The larger the virus icon, the more deadly. Here's the Spanish flu and the HIV AIDS pandemic. And of course, today we are dealing with COVID-19. Okay, let's stop the story right here. You can see this graphic from March 18th, 2020, shows nearly 9,000 COVID-19 related deaths. 9,000, that is less than Ebola, swine flu, Hong Kong, Asian flu. This was just one week after COVID-19 was officially declared a pandemic. Now I wanna show you the updated graphic. Watch here just how much COVID has grown from 9,000 deaths to 4.5 million lives lost to COVID-19, which is now more than Ebola, swine flu, Hong Kong, and Asian flu. In terms of the death toll from highest to lowest, the bubonic plague, which was spread by fleas, killed 200 million people in the 1300s. Smallpox in the 1500s killed an estimated 56 million, the majority children. Back in March of 2020, COVID-19 was all the way down here toward the end of the timeline with those 9,000 deaths. Today, it has moved all the way up the timeline, just a few spots down from HIV AIDS, which has killed 25 to 35 million. COVID-19 right now is represented with these lines through the virus icon because the death toll is still growing relatively quickly.